fatigue and malaise and all of that, not sleeping well. I'm going to take a drop of your blood by pricking your finger here, putting it on a slide, and we're going to look at it under the microscope. You ready for a prick? Quite a bit of rouleau formation, quite a bit of clumping. And um, the role of the red blood cell is to transfer oxygen, and so it's much easier if it, to do that off the surface area if they're separated and if they're flowing freely. The plasma's clean, um, but this, this is a picture of low oxygen. I understand you had your blood test? I did. And we had a little rouleau, a little blood clumping? We did. I also understand that you have a um, blood disorder. Is that the right term? The, yes. It's a medical term? I've What's just it? been diagnosed with a blood disorder called thrombocythemia, which mm -hmm. basically means that my bone marrow makes too many platelets. Mm -hmm. um, and while it's not a life-threatening illness at my age, um, the chance for blood clots is is more probable for someone mm -hmm. like me. With okay, this. sure. Um, and describe to me again, it had something to do with the bone marrow, say that again? The bone marrow is making too many platelets and the platelets are what cause blood to clot. Okay, and that would be the medical description Correct. of what you're doing, yes. okay, or, or what's, what, you're deal what you're dealing with. What I'm curious about, and understand I'm not even a doctor, okay, I'm curious about what causes that. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. I mean, it's, a, it's, it's sort of a, 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 a chemical description. Uh, which is what the medical profession does, sure. you know, but, but I'm curious about that. And in my experience, I've often found that, that the cause of a lot of diseases, this is just my experience now, I'm not playing doctor, but it's unresolved emotional stuff. The angers, the guilt, the traumas, the stuff that we carry around uh, and collect over, over a lifetime, mm. okay? So basically that's what EFT aims at, okay. you know, so. But anyway, we're gonna do a little EFT here. I wanted to ask you something else first though. Um, on a scale of zero to ten, because I heard you when you're having your blood test taken that your energy was low, okay? On a scale of zero to ten, where ten is you're ready to skip rope, you know, and you have very high, high energy, and zero is I want to go to bed, you know, because you're that down, okay? What number would you be at currently, right now as we speak? I'm going to say about a four. About a four. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, have you have done EFT before or not? Um, I've... I'm familiar with it. I haven't done it, but I okay. know Okay. Well, what you want to do is just kind of tap along with me. Okay. And, and I'll show you where the points are. Okay. And I'll have you say certain things. Okay. And you need to say them whether you believe them or not. It's just sort of a routine that we go through. Great. Okay. So anyway, go right here. Say, even though um, I have this low energy. Even though I have this low energy. Uh, and it may well be because my blood is all clumped. It may well be because my blood is all clumped. And the and with clumped blood cells. And with clumped blood cells. There's just not enough oxygen carrying capacity. There's just not enough oxygen carrying capacity. To give me the kind of energy that should be normal. To give me the kind of energy that should be normal. And some of my blood cells are formed in what's called rouleau. And some of my blood cells are formed on what's called rouleau. Which is like stacks of little cells, like stacks of dimes. Which is like stacks of little cells, stacks of dimes. Okay. Uh, and that's the way it is, and my energy is really way down. And that's the way it is, and my energy is really okay. way down. Uh, my blood cells are clumped. My blood cells are clumped. And my energy is way down. And my energy is way my down. My blood cells are clumped. My blood cells are clumped. And my energy is way down. And my energy is way down. My blood cells are clumped. My blood cells are clumped. And my energy is way down. And my energy is way down. My blood cells are clumped. My blood cells are clumped. And my energy is way down. And my energy is way down. Okay. I'd like to ask, ask you a question now. Just assess your energy. Is it still at a four? No. W what would you um, estimate? I'm going to say it's like a six or a seven right now. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Now the karate chops <sighs> Um, even though I just had a 50% increase in, in energy. <laughs> even though I just had a 50% increase in energy. In probably a minute or two. In probably a minute or two. Um, uh, that's good. That's good. <laughs> okay. Uh, maybe my blood cells are unclumping. Maybe my blood cells are unclumping. Maybe not. Maybe not. We don't know because we can't look inside right now. We don't know because we can't look inside But right we now. have evidence anyway. But we have evidence anyway. Okay. This blood cell clumping. This blood cell clumping. And my really low energy. And my really low energy. Oh, uh, but this blood cell clumping. This blood cell clumping. And my really clumping. low energy. And my really low energy. This blood cell clumping. This blood cell clumping. And my really low energy. And my really low energy. This blood cell this clumping. This blumping. blood cell clumping. And my really low energy. And my really low energy. Okay. 
uh, energy-wise, will we just still be a six or seven? Uh, seven, maybe moving up a little, yeah, okay. until like the eight range. Well, I'm curious, how do you know that? Is it just a general feeling, or is there something else going on physically that you could, um, you could point to? I'm, I'm feeling just energy vibrating through my body, moving through my body. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we're we're we are. Um, uh, stimulating the various energy meridians, mm. you know, that circulate through the body. So that would stand to reason. It's working. To me. Okay. All totally right. working. All right. Good. All these emotions. 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 All right. Check out energy. Of, what was the last number? Seven. Seven. I'm ended at like an eight. I'm gonna get a good eight right now. Oh, you are. Yeah. Okay. All right. Wow. Uh, all, all this very lethargic energy. All this very lethargic energy. I feel energy. so down. I feel so down. I'm really down. I'm really down. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep tapping, okay? <laughs> okay. All right, my dear. We're going to take another check at your blood, okay? Great. Hi, Lynn. Let's try sticking you one more time. See if we see a difference in your live blood picture after doing the EFT session that you did. Okay, here we go. Wow, what a huge difference. Cells are completely separated. So far, I don't see any clumping at all. I don't see any rouleau. Nice round. That picture right there really is a, what you'll see in the textbook as a description of what healthy, normal blood looks like. Mm -hmm. Red blood cells are separated, they're flowing freely, they're bouncing off of each other. They can therefore do their job a whole lot easier. Significant change after just a few minutes of EFT. It's amazing. Yeah, just really nice.